Going up the goat trail. Ah. Carrying a energy drink, a fishing pole, and a backpack full of goodies for trout. What a beautiful spot. There's nothing like spring trout fishing. Look at these guys up here. Kind of get spread out. It's nice. Oh, I can see him down there. I got one. Oh, you guys saw that. Just a little guy. That's pretty cool. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's been so long. It has been so long since I have been trout fishing. Um, I don't know why I haven't gone trout fishing in so long, but I absolutely love it. And I was driving on the way down here with Mikey B and with Logan, his son, and I just got more and more excited. I got, I got goosebumps right now. I got more and more excited the closer we got. And the reason why is because, frankly, I used to do this all the time and I know these spots really well and we are gonna crush them today. So stick around, Fish Brain Shane here, as you know, and the channel is growing like crazy. I really appreciate it. And you guys, if you haven't subscribed and turned on notifications yet, shame on you. 98% of you that are watching aren't subscribing yet. Am I doing something wrong? I don't know. <laughs> Catching a lot of fish. If that's wrong, I don't want to be right. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, let's see if the music's over there. Oh, there it is. Let's go fishing. Let's go fishing. Let's go fishing now. All right, so this is going to be one of those days where this new backpack that I got is going to come in very handy. 30 bucks at Walmart? You got to be kidding me. Very excitement. Very excitement. Very. Okay, let's see, half a crawler, will that work? Hopefully it will. I'm just excited. I don't even know what's gonna happen here, but I'm gonna try it up this way. Maybe a little bit quieter. So a lot of this is sight fishing, or it can be. Let's throw in here and see what happens. I don't know if the swarm's gonna be the ticket or not. We're gonna see. Got one there, yanked him out. First fish, just a little guy. And I don't think it's a trout, is it? Oh, it is a trout. First trout of the day. Heck yeah, just a little feller though. See him? Let's get him up so you can see him there. Might be a little brookie. Kind of looks like a little brook trout. I'm not exactly certain if it is or not, but I thought it was a I thought it was a fall fish at first. Turns out it's a little trout. We're gonna put him back. Get old Meg in there. See you later, buddy. Let's see what's up in this slack water, huh? Look at how clear that water is. It's beautiful. Definitely see fish. Oh yeah, there's fish down there. There's a fish. That's a good one. Nice. Come on out of there, oh yeah. Decent. Looks like a little brown trout, you guys. They're getting a little bit bigger. Just getting them on. The one thirty-second of an ounce jig with a little bit of worm on it. Look at that guy. Getting close to edible size, right? Pretty little fish. Let's get him back in the water as gently as we can here. I'm going to just kind of lo loft him in. Ready? See you later, buddy. There he goes. Is there one in there, Mike? Oh, I had a bite, I had a bite. I had a bite. I had a bite. 
seriously. everybody but I'm gonna put him back up here so he doesn't spook the other fish sorry I have to be a little bit quiet that's what we want to do all right let's get him back in oh there he goes see you later buddy so that's my setup I'm gonna use right now a little bit of power bait on a hand tied jig yeah let's see what happens Oh, I got a bite. Uh, you guys? No, I got a bite reeling in. Like, spinners would be good. Oh, I just had one. Yes. Dang it. I wonder if I should throw a bobber on this. I just missed another one. That was a good bite. That was a big fish. You guys, and I'm not pulling anything up. Like that was a that was a hell of a bite. I'm gonna throw a bobber on for a sec and uh, try that. But I really think, yeah, I, I just think it would be better the other way. I gotta get deep too with this bobber. That's the problem. Like deep. So I got that jig out there on, on uh, bobber. Nibbler. Got one. Got a. F oh, got off. Oh, dude. These are tricky little guys, guys with the tricks. Oh, I'm gonna get one. <laughs> but I had to cast like this, like hold my jig. Oh yeah. Like that. Oh, and I almost got in that tree. Did you see that? I got a bite like right away. And then I, I didn't know for sure if it was a bite, so I kind of pulled it back a little. And then I definitely got a bite. There's a bite. Come on, bite it again. Come on, you know you want. Oh, dude, there's a bite right away. There's none. There's a fish. Stay hooked, you son of a gun. Oh yeah, fighting good. Oh, nice. That's a nice little trout. All right, looks like a rainbow, but I'm not sure. Let's get it to stop wiggling. It's a brown, nice brown. Best brown of the year for me so far. Nice fish. What a pretty fish. Holy cow. Gosh, probably, I don't know, probably nine, 10 inches. Check them out, Mike. Look at that. You guys, this is special. I haven't been trout fishing in a long time. And to catch a trout like this, it's this beautiful. Look at the pink underneath. That's a beautiful brown trout. I'm going to get down here. Yeah. I'm going to get down here and release him nicely as I can. Oh, sorry. Get on out of here. There he goes back down into the dips. That back like. down into the dips. 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 I'm so excited. That's awesome, man. That's <laughs> that worked out good. I tried to high five you and you walked away. <laughs> oh, there we go. 
There you go. Get him, Mikey. Take it. Get him. You got him? Got him baby. There you go. Got him, baby. That away. Yeah. Mike's first trout in Minnesota, man. Oh, he came off. <laughs> Watch out for the oh, he's one. digging. He's digging. Look at him dig. He there he is. Okay. <laughs> you You're got right, him. Man, he's muscular. They're so awesome. So muscular. Can I whip him? I mean, you can. You I don't can. think people do usually. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that guy. I'm going to have to get a picture of you, Mike. That's so awesome. What a beautiful fish. Gosh, that's cool. What a beautiful fish, dude. Okay. Good job. All right, see you, bye. All right he's back. <laughs> he's gone. That was about the size of the ones earlier. Good job, Mikey, man. Your first trout in Minnesota. It's so awesome. That away. <laughs> All right, lady, let's reel it in, bud. We're going to go look at another pool. There should be one just right here. Yeah, old school, some barbarian stuff here. Just missed one. I don't know if you saw that or not, but that was pretty cool. Nice little spot here. So what they're biting today is these little crappie nibblers on kind of a little flu flu or hand tied jig. One thirty second of an ounce. And that's what I've been getting a lot of my fish on. Let's see if we can get us another one here. Some redemption here. This is frustrating in a good way, though. Missed this fish over here twice. I don't know if I'm gonna get a third shot at him or not. Let's give it a moment here. Let's just give it a moment. I'm gonna just let it settle down. This is more finesse fishing than I'm used to. I mean, this is awesome. I was saying earlier, it's like a combination of fishing and hunting. It's just amazing how fun this is. So there's a whole bunch of little ones, I think, down there. Maybe there's a big one. Let's see. There we go. Oh, another little one. Just little guys. <laughs> This is kind of fun, but it's nothing with any size. All right. I got to come down this way. That's where I was. Just got one here. Okay, you guys. <laughs> I didn't get... He tried to popcorn release on me. I didn't get the hook set or the fight, I don't believe, for this fish. We'll see. But look at how beautiful of a trout, you guys. Probably a, I don't know, 15, 20 pounder? I'm not sure. <laughs> beautiful little trout there. I'm gonna go ahead and put him back. Get him back in there nicely. He's been out long enough. And there he goes. And that's nowhere near the biggest one that I see out there. Woo. I didn't get the fight, because my battery was running out, but, it was kind of on a jerk like that. I was jerking it like this. And that's what they responded to. Got one. Jeez, I was just getting my lunch ready. And I got one here. Wow. 
little fish. Put a worm on. Yeah, I just put a worm under a bobber and little brown grabbed it. Nice little guy. Whew. Falling down. <laughs> we'll get him unhooked here. So I just put on a plain hook and a worm and I looked up and he had it. There we go. All right. Look at that little feller. Little big guy. Woo. And he gone. See you later. <laughs> He's all right. What a fun time it's been and what a beautiful place. Lots of scenery, nice clear water, and we've just been loving getting out there and kind of traveling around and hiking through the woods and looking for trout. It's been about 15 years for me since I've done this, and it was awesome to see Mikey B get his first trout in Minnesota, man. That was great. And uh, Mike hasn't been trout fishing in Minnesota very much, and he's pretty excited to start this uh, kind of passion back up because he, uh, his dad trout fished a lot out in Colorado and you know he really likes this kind of thing you know getting out and hiking and really looking for fish and it's a big challenge as you've seen so I do appreciate you joining me make sure you subscribe if you haven't and you know what for me for Mikey B for the trout for Logan for everybody in Minnesota fish brain shout